It reminds me of like Lost, except there's a lot of people on it, not just some, and probably less, you know, smoke monsters and things like that. Today's trip will be to the island of Capri. Now Capri was built in the, actually I don't know anything about the island. It's just, it's out in the water, there's like stuff on it and people on it and then we're taking a boat. That's all I know. Hopefully I learned something today. I probably won't. Well, I know a little history about Capri. Capri yes. was a term, the, uh, the impetus of the term was from the Roman era where the slaves were pants. used to torture. No, they wore short pants. And when they, they were tortured, they, they wore were... pants down to about here. It looked very funny. People would make fun of them. And when we got to America, I said, they're not doing that. Yeah, that's right. And uh, the reason why that. the pants were shorter, right below the knees, they would chop the leg off right around the shin as a form of torture and they, they brought pants to those and then the emperor would took the pants put them on goes hey this is actually quite cool people seem to like and the style yeah. style this is very interesting heading out to sea now and we're going to the island of capri where i have no idea what to expect but i'll find out when we get there a nice a little boat we have about one two three four five six of us six peoples and um, two uh, crew Behind me is the island of Capri. It reminds me of like Lost, except there's a lot of people on it, not just some, um, probably less, you know, smoke monsters and things like that. It's kind of neat because everybody on that island right now got there by boat. There are no roads. Well, maybe they took a helicopter. I guess if you're rich, you might have taken a helicopter. Helicopter or more likely a boat. I don't know how else you can get there unless you like scuba dive, swam. Maybe somebody swam. I could probably swim there, but most people couldn't. Hey, Mike. Very nice, very uh, clear water. Uh, if you 
go down in there. I wish I could have recorded under the water, but I didn't really bring a camera for that this time. Next time, maybe. But there are lots of tiny fish. Not big fish, but really tiny fish, very colorful. Uh, it's pretty cool from right next to the, uh, the bottom of the island. So this is uh, what we've done so far. We're going to keep you close. you'll find a lot of the narrow passageways with old stucco like walls kind of thing and going down you can see the ocean so you can get a little bit of a workout your legs legs will be nice and strong if you live here you definitely will have strong legs although I, I imagine after a while all the climbing will get a little tiresome for me it's fine <laughs> The entire walk seems very picturesque, like it's built to impress the entire way from the top to the bottom. Ah, it's quite enjoyable, but it's nice to be at the top. This definitely seems like one of the most pleasant places on earth to stroll around. These paths are just magnificent. You look out, this is what I see to my left. Not a bad view. You can't feel it, there's a nice gentle breeze blowing. And lots of little, uh, lots of things to see. Very picturesque, as I mentioned. Uh, cliff walls, it's one of the cool points. And now we reach the point where you can look out into the entire ocean. So on the island, there's two parts. There's the Ana Capri and Capri proper. And if you come, you have to be able to get to those two areas. And there's a bus system. It's not bad, it's very cheap. I mean, kind of either seven for the day or 250 each bus ride. Um, but it takes time. There's like 15 minute waits or half an hour waits. And then there's a bus ride itself. So that's a cheap way to do it, but you're gonna lose a lot of time. And if you're only here for three hours, that time can go by fast. Now, if you take a, oh man. If you take a, hey Davin. If you take the taxis, the taxis are of course extremely expensive, but they're dedicated just to you and you'll get there much, much faster. But is it worth price? That's your call. Yeah. 